Hello YouTube, this is Blackberry Pi, and today I will be showing you how to install an application with a 16-bit installer within a 64-bit Windows operating system. First, you will need VMware Player. This is a freeware virtual machine for any operating system, but I will be using Windows XP Home, which is obviously a 32-bit operating system. And I will be making one change. Well, actually, let me explain. It's free. It's a 101 megabyte installer. You install it. Then you insert or mount the disk for the operating system of your choosing. And it will install that operating system within the virtual machine. Once that is finished installing, which will take the normal amount of time for installing whatever operating system you are doing, you will get to your desktop or whatever like so and I'm going to be making one change from the default settings I'm gonna left click the little CD icon here click settings and I'm going to change my CD drive from the D drive to the E drive and in Windows 7 here D drive is my physical DVD drive and the E drive is my virtual Daemon Tools Lite CD, DVD, BD-ROM drive, like so. And within uh, VMware Player, it will still appear as D, but just ignore that. All right. And now, mount the image. And here we have the install come up. I'm going to maximize this. So now I'm within Windows XP install. We're in Time in Car is Carmen San Diego is one of my favorite games from my childhood and it actually was released in 1997 by Broderbund. It was re-released somewhere around 99 by The Learning Company. Uh, and it only takes up five, about 5 megabytes of space on your local computer because it runs off of the disk. Mine at last, the one and only Acme Chrono Skimmer. Prepare for a wild ride, my friends. This new time travel device will allow us to tunnel back in time and steal history's greatest treasures. I'm going to drop each of you off at a different time and place in history. Your job is to steal a historical object. Each of you will receive a note revealing exactly where to hide until I pick you up. Don't forget, tear up that note so no Acme agents can track you down. Chrono Skimmer activated. History awaits! Welcome to Acme Time! So, as you can see, it works just fine and wonderfully. And in theory, this should work for any 16-bit uh, install or application, or for that matter, even more generally, any historical game for any 
old operating system that it used to work on. This is BlackBerry Pi.